quick video I thought I'd do for you guys um, about clipping nails. I see Dobie's like jumping up and whatnot. Well, he did as a pup and was an absolute nightmare getting torn up to shreds. So we had an attempt to um, clip his nails. I went and bought some clippers here from Pets at Home. And uh, it was a nightmare. It couldn't go any worse. It made him really scared of them. Literally, you'd try sitting him down, taking his paw, and then he'd just want to pull away and wrestle away. And uh, so it's just give up in the end. And I've done some looking re and uh, YouTubing, found a video, and it really uh, helps get him over the fear of them. So um, I had a go at the, yeah, I had a go at doing that. It literally took two or three days. Um, on the video, it said it could take two or three weeks, like depending on how fast the dog takes to it or enjoys it in the end, but um, he done really well. So I'm gonna sit down in here and talk you through it. It only took, like I said, two or three days, but it's all about approaching. You've got to make out they're a good thing. You've got to associate these with being good. So you do use treats and whatnot. So from the start, all you really want to do is get them associated with them being a good thing. So you'd sit him down, or let him sniff him, so there's nothing wrong with him. Like that, and then you'll be a treat. So this is step one. Treat. Okay, so you keep doing that a few times. You can do it in a day or two days. And then the next thing will be sitting down, just put him next to him. Like that. I might move the camera here a bit. Hopefully you can see. Come here, Tom. Sit. Just put them down next to them. They might pull away. If they do, just keep doing it. And as soon as they say that stay there and they're happy from being there, it's another treat. So you do that a good few, uh, few times or even another night. Just make them up, do 10 minutes a night. And the next one will be sit down. Put them down next to him and then pour. So you do sit, pour, and then put them back down, take them away, another treat. You do the same again, put it down, pour. So they're so straight, and all the time you've got them around, so it's a good thing because you're going to get a treat. And then you progress from that to put them down, pull, pull, and then pick them up, and then put them down, pull down, trick. So you can see you're progressing, um, progressing the stage with lots, gradually getting him used to having his paw, moving these about, and then yeah. From there, I think it was um, put down next to him. Poor. Tommy, poor. Hold it near him, like that. And then down, poor, another treat. And this could be a few days in, or a week in, even, depending on how much the dog would been taste to it. And then it progresses from there. So the next one would be poor, Tommy. Poor. It's even better if they're laying down. This is the big step. So you take the paw, and you touch the now. Just tap the now. And then down and through. Up, up. Sit. Stay. It does help if they know sit and stay. So yeah, you do that a few times, so it would be poor. Tommy, pop. Pull. These tricks in there. Let me pull. So that. Just touch them now. Down the trick. When they get good at that, that's when you want to go in for the uh, for the kill, so to speak. So it is. Do that. Pull. Hold it there. Clip. When you've done the clip, it is high value treats. 
of that, you can get this, the, the uh, squeezy cheese and they love all that, that sort of stuff. And um, yeah, I mean, when, when, whilst you're doing it, you do want to, whilst you've got this pour, handle the pour, go like that, move it in the first few steps so you get used to you, um, you know, moving the pour about, about separating the, uh, the fingers whilst doing that. Tap them without clipping in the training stage, just getting used to the, the, the tapping, you know. He would run a mile as soon as I'd pick these up. And this wasn't even four or five months ago. And now he's still a bit finchy. But he lets me do it. Good boy. So yeah, lots of praise. Try and use your low, um, low fat treats and whatnot, because you will go through a lot of them. And... Uh, just keep at it, you know, don't get frustrated if it don't work straight away. Uh, if it, it takes a few days just to get him to sit and go like that and then take away the treat. You just want him to get him to know they're a good thing. And that is about it. It took us two or three days max. And then we can go like that, clip all of them, get even the nail file now, file them down. Perfect. Uh, yeah. So that is my little tip to you. I'm not used to doing these sort of videos, but um, it really worked well for us. And you can see I haven't got any scratches or anything because I'll keep, them, keep on top of them so well, you know. Uh, that's about it. So I hope you enjoyed the vid. And uh, his name's Tommy, by the way. And uh, yeah, let me know what you think and let me know how you get on. I hope this helps. Say bye, Tom. <laughs>